to the, the whole paths up the mountain thing, aren't we? Um, is it more respectful to the various faiths to say that they are all valid paths up a mountain and they're all heading towards the same place? And, and again, I would repeat that uh, the only person who could say such a thing would be someone with a God's eye view of it. Uh, the only person who could say such a thing is someone who thinks they're already on top of the mountain. So I don't think it's just subtly uh, a problem, this kind of religious pluralism. I, I, I think it's, it's a very great problem. I, I think that uh, to understand uh, Christianity, for instance, the, the, the most basic truth about who is Jesus, and that this is the heart of the, the Christian faith, not so much a moral code, but the person of Christ, the most basic fact about him, is that he is the Christ, the Son of God. And as soon as I say Christ, I have offended Malcolm. And I don't mean to, but I do. And as soon as I say the Son of God, I've offended Abdul. I don't mean to, but I do. And that, that is who Jesus is. Uh, and so I do think we need to be absolutely clear on, on those sorts of things. But I'm not offended. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. Do <laughs> you believe it? I don't have to believe it. Um, if I give an example, I was once asked at a meeting, um, do you not believe that um, you missed the vote by not accepting Jesus? And I said, maybe I did miss the, the vote. I reserved the right to miss the vote, but I'm very glad that you caught the vote. <laughs> <laughs>